chunk of metal. And big chunks of metal with open cars do not go well, especially open cars without halos on them, um, he said. Got a feel for Hazel. He just set the fastest first sector before he had his interruption. Oh, no, and another big off and nasty, nasty That's crash. Sure. That's sure. That's sure. Yeah, that is short in the wall in the 29 car, the Arrows A4. That's going to possibly bring out a red flag because that is wedged into the wall and there's no crane there. They've got an, uh, a get out clause, if you will, about 10 yards up the, the road and he's able to get away from harm's way. But and no one's going to read that penthouse that, anytime soon. And that's a big old whack on the exit of Tobacco, unfortunately. I really do hope it's good to see him get out of the car yeah. under his own steam because yeah, that, uh, yeah he really would have felt that uh, with the low tub sides and everything quite a frightening accident uh, for sure unfortunately uh, falling out of uh, what was uh, a pretty uh, decent position in the race and uh, and that look at all the bodywork he strewn slid all over. right down that wall I wouldn't be surprised to see a full course yellow here here we go coming out so I wonder look, if look watch this yeah he's, he he's, has he's picked up that debris he's and picked up that debris and flicked it back I don't know whether that was part of I, the I event may well be you know oh oh that oh wow no, no, that's a big uh, big smash that's failed something yep. in that car has failed and I think it was the debris he picked up that like we said it's a big chunk of metal and I think it's got onto the car and ripped part of the car's underbelly. Could well have done. I, I, uh, I'd like to see the other angle on it, honestly, before I, I, I judge too much. But okay. in any case, I, I, I feel like that, that car has let him down somewhere uh, because just be purely the approach speed of yeah, the yeah. impact. Yeah. Um, and it will be extremely unfortunate if that is due to the debris which was left on the exit of the Nouvelle Chicane. Good to see David is OK, though, and obviously concerned about the car itself. But, uh, yeah, any doubt that you may have had that these guys are taking it easy. <laughs> yeah, I, I really think we've got an FCY now, but I really think that uh, a slightly... Uh, Hair, more, uh, a slightly more hair trigger approach to uh, neutralising these races might be helpful, uh, given uh, some of the debris that we've seen on track throughout this race weekend. Yeah, I, I, I hear you. Like I said, they'll be able to get it out of harm's way fairly quickly now when they've got it on the dolly because it's only 10 yards away. Here we go. Well, they've got a, a schedule to meet, but uh, that is a lot of damage to uh, that 29. But uh, most important thing is that there is no damage to David Shaw. Dry shaft sitting out there. Yeah, bits of, uh, <laughs> bits of shaft and axle everywhere, uh, unfortunately. And bits of uh, fiberglass bodywork as well. And uh, just looking to see yeah. the, uh, if the... Because obviously they're, they're not as uh, we well go. sorted with the, the panels. There is that piece of... There that is was that. what the original accident yes. left that left that uh, piece of bodywork, but uh, it, it's difficult. Then here we go, watch yeah, this. It's difficult to know how that could have... Yeah, it got on, it got churned underneath the car, but didn't I, it? I'm not sure how that has caused the car to fail. 